friends this is divya goel welcome to my channel creative study with coding where we learn c coding in an effective way from day 1 but before that if you have not subscribed to my channel yet do subscribe it like and comment in comment section share it as many as possible so that your friends can also learn it so friends what is coding actually why should we learn it who should learn it let's find out the answer with me you must have seen many people are very busy with their mobile phones computers desktops so what do they do actually do you have ever notice that they play games they send letters or emails to a number of people they watch movies they play music even they participate in online examinations they study online and there are so many things to do on computers or in mobile phones and these things are possible to make through this coding what we call programming in computer language in this way we came to know that coding is a computer language so why do we learn it we learn coding to create or develop computer or mobile apps who should learn it or what kind of people want to learn it students of computer science like bca mca and engineering students learn coding to create or develop such apps which are used by common people in this video we'll just focus on coding and we'll go through the theory part at the end of the video so let's get started quickly this is the format which you have to follow each time during code writing in computer language the small bracket is termed as function these are read as main function clr scr function get ch function where all the messages and calculations are done inside the main function clscr is used to clear the screen get ch is used to hold the messages written there are two important functions printf function which is used to print the messages on the screen and scanf function which is used to enter the value from the keyboard I'll discuss in detail about scanf function later. And a semicolon is used at the end of the each statement. Since computer doesn't understand human language, so all the codes are written in a compiler which converts human language to machine language. There are two types of compilers used to write C or C++ code, Turbo and GCC. Let's say the coding to print hello world. You can print anything in printf function. This is an icon of Turbo C or C++ compiler and you have to follow these steps. First of all, write all codes in C compiler, save it with .c extension, compile it by using all plus F9 and run it by control plus F9. You can see the icon of Turbo C compiler on the computer screen. Just double click on this icon and write the C codes. After clicking on the icon, we get this screen where codes are written. After that, compile it by using Alt plus F9. Then run it finally by using Ctrl plus F9 and get the result. Now we got the result Hello World. Now this is a live demo to write and run C code. Save the program with .c extension. If the same file name exists, overwrite it. Now write the code over here. First of all include two header files stdio.h and conio.h where stdio.h is known as standard input which contains scanf function and printf function whereas conio.h is known as console input output which contains clrscr function and get ch function
here void means main function is returning nothing semicolon is used at the end of each statement printer function prints the messages written inside the quotation here i have written hello world inside the double quotation Keep saving your program. Now compile it by using all plus F9 and it will and it will show whether it has error or not. If there is no error, it will print the output. If I make CLSCR unaffected by using double slash you can see output screen is not clean see how the CLR SCR works similarly get ch function has become unaffected by using double slash if I remove double slash it works again now it is holding all the values on the screen at last save the program by using save or f2 and create the program thank you so much for watching the video and keep watching such valuable videos stay safe bye bye and see the theory related to the topic in the description box and if you have any doubt any query you can comment in the comment section